G'day everyone, I am Nilzy, and this video is all about the four t-shirts that you could have collected over the previous weekend when the Ill-Got Games video came out. You can click on my video that I made about the DLC which is on the screen right now. That gives you a little bit of information about what came in that DLC and a little bit of my feedback about it or opinions about it. Now, I've already done a video about the first crate drop. You can check that on screen right now. This video is going to be all about the other three t-shirts that you need to collect. Now, I have to say that it was pretty easy to get these ones. I was pretty lucky, I think. So, uh, let's have a look. Okay, what we're going to do, we are after a crate. It's already said that there's three hours to go. We're sitting in a buzzard on top of a building, just waiting for the crate to drop. The best thing about this is I've got no one else in my lobby, so this is going to be just a e quick, easy one. I'm going to cheat a little bit. I'm going to shoot everything from the sky and then just casually stroll in and pick up the crate. Hopefully, oh, okay, so here it is. We've dropped and let's go check out where it's going to be up here okay cool away we go okay we've made it so as I said before we're just going to shoot out Everyone that's on the ground, it locks onto them, which is really easy to do. And it is a bit of a cheating way, but we're just going to do it anyway, just so we can get this crate nice and simple. We don't have to worry about dying or anything, or making it too difficult for ourselves when there's only me in the lobby. There we go, we've killed everyone around, just going to grab this crate, what did we get? It is a fake Santo Crapper t-shirt. Alright, well that was pretty simple, let's go for the next one. So the next shirt we got was the Dis t-shirt, or formerly known as the Dix, as the designer one. Let's see how we got it. Righto, so what are we going to do this one is, uh, I might do this in first person, we're going with a different tactic, we're going with the jet. Now there is one other person in the lobby, so they're making it really difficult for me, aren't they? <laughs> I don't know how this is planned out. So uh, what we're going to do, we're just going to wait around here, I'm sitting at Sandy Shores Airfield. I've got my jet lined up to the runway, so all I need to do is jump in, go into first person, and fly straight out of here. Okay, it's dropped, so let's go. We're gonna get into the jet first. So you head the direction to the jet, so he starts getting into the jet while you're checking him on the map. All right, so now I'm halfway in already. We're in, and all we need to do is take off, we're in first person, let's go! Okay, it's uh, dropped now, so when we're about over the top of the area, we're going to get out, so we can fly down. Oh, I've always wanted to try to get that mid-air. Alright, let's just parachute down so we can land in a good spot. I don't want to land right on it. Uh, you can do that. If you're good, you can land right on top of it. We're just going to land over here. I just want to... It's a bit easy. I'm in first person, so... There you go. It makes it so much easier when you can just automatic lock on. I should do this without uh, auto lock. To check what it's like. Is that all of them? Normally there's a couple behind the log over here, but we'll just get it anyway. Look at that. Done. And uh, that is how easy it is. We picked up a fake dick shirt. Great. Okay, this is the last shirt we ended up getting. It's the Poppin shirt. And uh, this is how we got it. 
Okay, so what I've decided to do on this crate drop, which has just said that it's inbound, we're going to go by jet. Okay, so I'm not going to do it first person, we'll just do it in normal. Alright, so as he's already getting in, we're miles away. Alright, there's a couple of people in this lobby. But I doubt they're going for it at all. Can take off down here. This is probably not the best place to take off from because you are a long way away from the other side of the map. But like I said, there's not many people in this lobby, so I doubt I'll have much competition for it at all. I'm pretty confident that I'll get it, so let's uh, let's get there first. Okay, we're ready to jump. Let's jump into it. Here we go. Oh, that looks so good. I love this game. Oh, nice flying down. Let's go over it. I think. No, we're going to land down here. Let's go straight down. Oh, shit, I'm going steep. Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, well, that was a uh, great tactic, that one. Land face first on the ground. And um, this is how you don't get a crate. Wow, the loading is real long. How long am I going to see this black screen for? Come on. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, well, there's no one going for it. So we're just uh, moseying on in. See where we can find our first person. Oh, hey, surprise! <laughs> uh, where else? Should be a couple more up around here. There's one. Should be one down here. Cool. Oh, I didn't kill him. All right, there we go. This is the last shirt. Shirt number four. Fantastic. All right. That's it. Radio, so that was all the four t-shirts that we had to collect. This crate drop has finished now, so there is no more crate drops. Hope you've enjoyed. See you next time.